Hello game devs, welcome back to another Chirval tutorial. So today um I will be showing you how to publish your game to itch.io. So um first of all, what is itch.io? Well, um itch.io is a website for users to host, sell and download indie video games. It was released in March 2013. Um the service Host over a hundred thousand games that's like a lot and items as of February 2018 um, h.io also allows users to host game jams um, during which participants have limited time to create a game um, that's where I created my last game jam um, okay so let's get a project to exports okay so I was working on this project and I feel um, okay, I should export it. It's supposed to be um, a tutorial which I'll be releasing later in um, May. Okay, so um, first of all, we need to export our, our project. So let's give this some details. So game settings, properties. Um, okay, so game name. I will give this jumper ball. That's supposed to be the name. Jumper ball. Okay, so game name. There we go. Same here. Um, I'm just filling this up. Jumper ball. Author name. Okay, apply. So that's okay. Now let's export it. You can do that by clicking on this to export the game um, button, or you can also do that in the file export. Here we go. So now export projects as a standalone game now. We don't need this. Um here we go. Upload your game directly from Chivalve. Um we don't need that. We need this which is a local folder. Build your game locally as a HTML5 game. You can publish it on website like Congregate, um, Game Show, Edge, and Poke. So in the future I would create a tutorial on how to publish your games on all those websites. So let's go local folder now you need to select a folder so choose a folder on desktop okay let's make our work organized so we'll create a new folder new folder um give it a good name which would be jumper ball okay so there we go we'll select this folder select folder and here we go so export Okay, so that's done. Um, here we go. Now you need to take note of this. Your game will work if you open index.html on your computer. You must upload it to web um, hosting. Um, here we go. Congregate edge. Okay, so let's go to our browser. I will be using Chrome. Okay, so here we go. This is edge. Okay, so first of all, you need an account. So you need to create an account. You cannot um, publish a game on Edge without an account. So I'm just going and login real quick. So here we go. Um, this is what it looks like once um you log in, you get this banner which you have to create and get all your projects on um get all your projects and this format you can edit that in the edit profile okay so let's go now click on this um here we go as you can see right here create to get your dashboard upload new projects of uh, sales and bundles host game jam well we don't need all this all we need is our upload new project so just click on that and here we go now you would be given this page so create a new project um title I would give this jumper ball so it's still a demo so a demo here we go okay so now you get this your project URL this is a URL which you get um so you don't have the right to edit this because it comes with your name by default this is my um URL so this is added um to it so you have the ability or the option to edit the uh, custom URL which you get for your project. So since I gave my game um jumper ball demo, I gave it here jumper ball demo. So two projects cannot have the same 
um, the same URL. Okay, so let's go. Um, now here we go. Here you get to write a short description or a tagline shown when um, we link to your project. Avoid duplicating your project. So here you get to write your um a short description about your game. Okay, so classification. Now you need to take note of this. So what are you uploading games a piece of software you can play so you need to select what type of game we get we have game assets because H is not only for um downloading games you also get game assets you get game modes you get physical games or um, we can play with devices you get soundtracks tools comics books others so now for this we will be selecting our game um games which is a piece of software you can play Okay, so kind of projects. This is download downloadable. So we have our HTML. Um, we have a Flash, Java. Um, okay, a Unity. Um. So once you select downloadable, you give your um your project the ability. You you give this a button which for your project to be downloaded and HTML. This is for your game to be um for your game played in the browser so for this um okay I'll just go with HTML let's select this HTML so you have a zip or HTML file that uh, will be played in the browser so release status here we go now you select all this um release project is complete but might receive some updates um okay mine is not complete um so I won't check release in development project is an active development so this is like it's okay it's in an early access that means it's um still being um developed so on hold development is paused for now we get this cancel development has stopped um we get prototype um okay so uh, early prototype for first thing an idea out fate of projects unknown truth for this um okay i'll just select okay it's not paused now Okay, just like this project is in active development. That's perfect. So here we go. Now we get the pricing. Um, so you have the ability or the opportunity or the option to set this to either a paid. You want your um game to be paid for before it's downloaded, or you want um the option to um get for people to get it free or to donate, and you also get no payments which um you don't want any donation so you just give it for free um okay so paid donate so we get all of this so okay i'll just select paid and okay we get the minimum of ten dollars and okay since we're going with paid i think i might have to go with um downloadable okay so downloadable one dollar um okay suggest an alternative nope not really Upload so now you upload your file right here. Upload file now. You have to select your file. Um, here we go. Jumper ball. Oh, sorry, it has to be in a zip format. So cancel and open your file location. Here we go. We have it here. So, um, left click um, 7 zip add to achieve. You can download 7 zip. The link would be available um, in the description of this video. So, okay. Now here we go, we've zipped this up and now upload file. Here we go, so now it's uploading. Okay. So that's done. Now you get to select this. Um it's an executable, so this since this would be an executable, so you just select that. And this would be a platform. We have the Windows logo on um, the Linux. We have the Apple, um, sorry, the Mac and the Android. Okay, so now this is where you select your format. Just in case you build um different versions, you upload. So this would be Windows. And let's say we have another format. Um, take note, it's the same thing. We'll just be duplicating this. So. Okay, we'll just do this copy and paste. Okay, so minimize. Let's go back and upload file. So 
let's say you have another format which runs for Android you upload it and so this would be for Windows um okay that's uploading okay so now you set, um, set this to Android if this formats or if this file you've uploaded is for Android you set it to Android and you will get um, the Android icon be side the name of it once it's uploaded so note this is both for um pc so i'm just setting this to android i'm um, just explain the facts here so now here we go set a different price for this file you have the um opportunity to set the file um set a price sorry this file is a demo and can be downloaded for free so you can check that and you get this hide this file to prevent it from being downloaded um okay you also, you can also check that okay so we get um this file is a pre other placeholder and hide this file to prevent it from being downloaded you don't want your file to be downloaded so you just check this it's the same here okay so details um this is the best best part this attracts um people so let's say um this is a jumper ball game this is a jumper ball game and okay so let's just look at that this is a jumper ball game for the device you give it a long description and add some elements like the html we get formats bold it leaks um strike through we get list table link align video and image so just adding whatever you feel would be great and would attract people Okay, so here we go. Um, select a category which best describes your game. Uh, so here you select a category. Let's say this is um okay. I'll just give this an action. Okay, that's perfect. Action, tag. So any other keywords? This is tags. Any other keywords? Someone might search to find your game. Max, of uh, then avoid using general or um platforms. Um, provide both. So here you select. That um tags or just like that's adventure since it's a 2D game 2D and I just something love 2D to the um is it Jitvolp? No, okay, I'll just add Jitvolp. Okay, so add Jitvolp. Um, pixel ads. Sorry, that's action. Um, pixel ads and okay, you can just keep going. Um, the limit is fan. So app store links. If your project is available on any of the App stores will link um to it so you just set your link here this is where you get your link the windows store you get the amazon google play apple steam and the windows store okay next up we have a custom now you can change how h.io refers your projects by providing a custom now okay this is optional that's great download and install instructions these are the instructions the person gets on how to um execute your your your, your game once downloaded um so you just set the best instruction let's say um extract it extract it and have fun okay so if you have a video showing how to execute your game or your projects um, you just fill in your video here, or you can get a YouTube link. Um, and fill it right here. So community. Okay, so community. Um, build a community. Um, for your project by letting people post to your page. We get sorry. Okay, so we get the disable comments. Add a nested comments thread to the bottom of your project page. I would recommend this. Um, so you get feedback from people. Visibility, so you can get public once you save. Um, this won't be available yet. Um, until you save this. And this best part, you get a cover image. Um, there's a minimum, um, three fifteen by two fifty, and recommended six twenty by five hundred. And also, you get um a YouTube or Vimeo, um trailer. You can add it right here. Just add your link, and it would show. Also screenshots. Um, I don't have screenshots now, so I will just add. Okay, the pipes. Okay, I'll just add this and also add this. 
But there we go, this is what it looks like and safe. Okay, so this is what it looks like. At first, if we had added um, a banner, it would be displayed at the top right here. Now we get the buy now. You have to purchase this before you, it can be downloaded. Um, I will take this out soon. Sorry about that. Now, here we go. Jump a ball, copy, get Android. So this is to show all that it's for Android. Also, we get the comments and the images which we attached to this so let's go back and edit this edit now this is um downloadable game okay so now let's edit something downloadable let's make it a html5 game and okay so this would be free now. Um, we get no payments and save. Okay, so now we can make this public. Um, that's still saving. Okay, so let's make this public and save. Okay, so view page that's saved now. So now loading game for the first time. Now here we go. So this is it. Um, run game. That's loading. And here we go. Okay. So there we go, that's how to embed your game on itch.io website. So, um, that's how it's done, that's how to publish your game to itch.io. Um, so this example is messed up, so I will take it down real soon. Okay, so thanks for watching. Um,